Hey YouTube, I'm checking uh, my new camcorder to see how well it's going to do. It's a Samsung something waterproof camera camcorder HD something blah blah blah. I'm going to mount it on the uh, riding mowers when I'm out riding and since it's waterproof it will be pretty good for the mud as well so I'm just uh, right now kind of zooming in on some stuff to see I don't know if it has macro but this isn't going to be like the the one for the up close stuff so I'm just kind of zooming in on things to see how it does so just bear with me set of keys not bad. Hmm. Trying to see if there's anything cool to show you. Um, this I'm making a, a pull behind wagon out of it. I'm going to take the pegboard out and uh, put in a metal bottom and I've got the wheels from um, some kind of airplane landing gear or something that I, I don't know where I got it from. I got it from the dump. Uh, there's my guard dog. Yeah, it's a creepy thing. Mm. That was a pause feature I just used to see. I think it'll be a handy little thing. Be good for making the videos to see what I can get and how close I can get right there to my charger. Not too shabby. <sighs> There's that mower. It's been sitting out there for about three days now. Just hadn't had time to work on it. Been doing other stuff. So, I have to prioritize my time. Um, and I guess I'm doing a sound check of the, of the speakers as well. There's my chain hoist. There's a bumper to the car that I'm going to be using on the little Murray. I'm going to cut it off and put it. It ought to look pretty good. Uh, mainly just to keep the mud from slinging up. I don't know about how sturdy it's going to be. I've got some aluminum reinforcements. Uh, I've got like a 20 foot piece of aluminum angle. And I'm thinking about cutting it and using it under it for bracing. Um, of course, I guess I could probably need to use... Honestly, got steel angle iron just to give it a little bit of a, a little bit of strength, get something to grab to when you're going sideways. Um, that's about it. I'm gonna go in here and see if I can download this software and work it. And that's about it. Let's see if I can turn the damn thing. Off. Hey YouTube, there's an update on the little Murray and what all has been going on what I've been doing um, as you can see I haven't really done a whole lot to the little Murray uh, other than just fix the small little mechanical glitches that keep coming up uh, putting new belts on it adjusting belts getting the carburetor squared away and everything the the small lot minor little nitpicky shit that I've had to take care of but that's I guess that's part of it. I'm filming with a new camcorder. This is uh, a Sanyo, I don't know, outdoor active shockproof waterproof camcorder. So I figured that'd be pretty good for doing some rides and some playing around. Here is the uh, bumper that I'm going to use to cut uh, to make some uh, 
fenders for this thing that'll keep all the mud down to a minimum. It's not too bad. Uh, still got to get the carb tweaked and everything. Let me see how the zoom works on this. I think it works pretty good. But I'm going to get it taken care of. There we go. Let me back up. And there's a problem that's come up with my Big Murray. I, all the linkage is just screwed up. It's all for shit. So I'm going to completely tear it apart and tear it down. And put it in a older craftsman body, I think. I've just had such a problem with the linkage and everything. Uh, I just keep bending uh, everything that I put in there. So I'm going to just put it in. And it's really about it. Not much more at the moment. I've uh, got a new welding helmet too. Auto darkening helmet. So that'll be really good. It'll help with my welding, I think. I think it'll help immensely. Um, this thing does good. It runs great. Uh, still smokes a little bit, but I don't care. Uh, if it runs for a week and then blows up, I've gotten my money out of it because it was free. So I'm not terribly concerned about that. The little bit of smoke. Uh, let's see what else, since this is kind of a test. I'll show you this is what I'm gonna put my big Murray my 17 and a half and then uh, the six-speed lock transmission I'm gonna put it in this one and I think that'll work really good but I, I just I had had so many damn problems with the other one it's just not any fun to ride anymore because I always have to stop and fix something and stop and fix something every 10 minutes. But that's it. I'm out. Bye-bye.